but how do you experiment in this? Look, how I would do it is I would simply invite in the students and go, I'm going to wire you up and then you're going to fall in love with me and I'm going to measure what happens there. <laughs> okay, yeah. That, 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 would that, that would I get funding? No, okay, fine, fair enough. They, uh, can you take a blood sample and see these uh, these chemicals? Are they, you know... It depends on the neurochemical. Oxytocin, absolutely. You can get oxytocin in lots of different ways. Wee, saliva, blood, whatever you want. The other ones involved in love, unfortunately, don't cross the blood-brain barrier. So we can't take a blood test. You can use a proxy... So my students who don't have quite as much money, um, they use proxies. And what that means is because we know uh, beta endorphin is a painkiller, what they will do is they will test somebody's pain threshold before they've done whatever social interaction it happens to be. And the ways we do that sounds awful, but we might uh, put a blood pressure cuff on your arm and inflate it until it reaches pain tolerance. And then you say, ow, that really hurts and we stop. Um, Or we might get you to plunge your hand into ice cold water and see how long you can do it for. Or over a hot plate, which we don't do that often because that can go wrong. But that's what you do then. And you get them to do whatever social interaction it might be and then you test the pain threshold again and the pain threshold will have gone up because beta endorphin has been released oh but my experiment where why don't you just fall in love with me that's unethical <laughs> but the, <laughs> that's great. and over a hot plate not a yeah, problem not a problem we have kind of yeah that so if I on. did that initially, the cold water, I think, taking my hand yeah. out, out of freezing water, then spent time with somebody I loved and then did it again I should feel you should, you should last longer Right, because okay. your pain tolerance has gone up. And generally we do find 